This is the Mate 60 Pro Durability and Drop Test. If you're interested in seeing more videos like this, make sure you subscribe and click on notification bell so you'll be notified once I upload a new video. And if you need any tools, there are links in the description. Last year's Mate 50 Pro with the Kunlun glass handled well on the drop test. However, it did receive a hairline crack after a few drops. You can watch that video to compare results. I'll place links in the description and in the info card on the top right of the video. I'll be removing the pre-installed screen protector before I start. Let's see how the second generation Kunlun glass handles the drops. Alright, for the first drop, I'll drop it on the screen from head height onto the concrete floor. There are some small scrapes on the screen from hitting the concrete floor, but the screen works fine and has no cracks. For the second drop, I'll drop it on the back from head height. The frame got a few more scrapes, but nothing too bad. The screen is still intact and works fine. For the third drop, I'll attempt to drop it on the side from head height. It landed on the back again and this time the camera bezel glass got a crack in it. There's also an additional scrape on the corner of the frame, but the screen has no further damage and works. For the fourth and final drop, I'll again attempt to drop it on the side, but this time from waist height. Again, it didn't manage to directly hit the side, but instead hit the back. There's an additional scrape to the frame, but the screen itself is free from any cracks and works great. Next, I'll be running the phone over with the car to see how it holds up. We can see that nothing really happened, and there isn't really any additional damage to the phone aside from some dust from the floor. Moving on, it's time to put the phone in some sand and gravel to check the scratch resistance. <laughs> So overall I'd have to say that the Mate 60 Pro handles drops very well, and this second generation of Kunlun glass is definitely impressive. For now Gorilla Glass stands no chance against Kunlun glass. Samsung and others should definitely look into incorporating this type of glass or something similar to their flagship phones. If you're interested in seeing the teardown, make sure you subscribe then you have notifications turned on so you'll be notified once I upload the teardown video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.